everyone welcome to tech wired in this video we are going to solve leap code number problem number 24 swap nodes in pairs so we have a linked list we need to swap the two adjacent nodes okay when whenever we have a pair of two nodes we just have to swap these two nodes then we need to swap the other two nodes okay so we will see the logic and the code for the problem so before solving this problem i would like to say please like and subscribe this will motivate me to upload more videos in future now we will dive into the logic and the solution so this is the first problem first example that has been given to us in the lead code so what it exactly says is we need to swap we need to swap these two first two nodes that has been detected Whenever you see a pair of two nodes first, we just have to swap like this, two on one. Then we need to move our pointers to here. Then we need to swap four and three. Okay. So we need to swap two adjacent nodes. What if we if we don't have a pair assume we have only one two and three okay in this case we will swap only two and one okay we will swap only two and one we will leave three as it is since it ha it doesn't have a pair okay we will see the solution using a dummy node now I will see how the pointers we are going to assign and how we are going to connect these pointers and solve the solution using a dummy node. So first I will connect, I will attach okay, the head pointer to the dummy node. This is my dummy node. I am going to name this dummy node as current pointer. I am going to assign a current pointer to my dummy node okay so in the first iteration i'm going to assign a first pointer and a second pointer okay so so for each iteration i'm going to shift the first and second pointer to each pairs so i'm then i'm going to use these pointers to connect to my dummy node and swap between each others okay I will use this current pointer to run my loop as well. I'm going to, I will be checking whether there is a node after and a one step ahead as well. So I'm checking whether there, that, whether there is a node present after the end node or the, is there any second node as well. I will show you in the diagram. So now I will assign the second pointer to my current dot next. So I will be swapping, attaching. Okay. Then I will attach the first dot next, the first node to the second node and the second node next value will be attached to this first node okay this is how it looks in the first iteration so this is my second pointer this is my current pointer and this is my first pointer the pointers will not be changed here so for the next iteration i will place my current pointer here now I need to check whether I need to run my loop for the next iteration or not. How I will check? If there is a node present after and after that. So I am checking whether there is a one, the next node is present and the next dot next node is present. So I need to check whether there is a pair or not. I will use this current pointer. So here there is another pair, right? 
so again i will assign first pointer here second pointer here and again i will do this swap so at this end of the second iteration so at the end of the second iteration my four will be here and three will be here my current pointer will be here now i need to check whether i need to run the loop or not here there is no pair present after this node so i will exit the loop i will just return it from here dummy dot next what if, if we have only odd number of nodes okay so i'm going to swap two and one in the first iteration okay my current pointer will be here i will be checking i will only run the loop whether current dot next is present and current dot next dot next is present whether there is another pair here or not here if there is no the there is no second node the second the pair for the node then i will exit the loop i will not run the loop i will just return as it is i will just return this one okay now we will see the code so first i will check whether there is a head present or not okay or if there is next node okay if there is no next node and there is no head i will just return head itself now i'm creating a dummy node here okay now i'm creating a dummy node dummy node here okay i'm going to attach the head to my dummy node i'm going to keep a current pointer to my dummy node as well okay now i'm going to run whether there is a node present after the end when we reach the end of the node end of the list i'm going to check whether whether there is a first node and there is a second node or not by next dot next okay then i'm going to place the first pointer and the second pointer using current dot next dot next so these pointers i'm going to use to swap current dot next is equal to second then first dot next second dot next then second dot next first okay then i'm going to change my current pointer okay then i'm going to return my dummy dot next i will run oops here it's capital n now it should work yeah we could see it's pretty much efficient so the time complexity for solving this particular problem is order of n since we iterate only once and the space complexity is also order of n since we use uh, an extra node right we are just connecting a dummy node to it we are creating a node we are creating a another new list so it's order of n so thank you for watching this video please like and share and subscribe this will motivate me to upload more videos in future and also check out my previous videos. Keep supporting. Happy learning. Cheers.